Hey, 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 intern Adam here, currently standing in for the arena guy at the Shot and Scene Center, getting so hyped for Monster Jam. And I'm joined by... Elvis Linez. Elvis, it's so good to see you again. Ian, where, where are you from? I'm from Houston, Texas. Born and raised there. Been living there for all 23 years of my life. Man, that, that's some Texas pride right there. We love to see it. That's so sweet. And so what truck are you driving today? So this uh, year, I'm actually driving the Toro Loco Monster Jam truck. If you guys remember me from last year, I was here with the Great Clips, the Mohawk Warrior. So to be back, you know, last year we were here at the Nationwide Arena. Now we're at the Schottenstein Center. So I'm really excited to be here, man. Dude, we're so happy to have you. This is going to be such a special day, such a special weekend, honestly. So can you walk me through a little bit of what, like, your mindset is before you, like, jump into a show? Like, how do you become one with the truck? Honestly, I think I've honestly uh, become one with the truck as the years have gone by. But every week I kind of try to push the limits of the truck and of myself and try to do something crazy for the fans. Ohio is honestly one of my favorite states to come to because the fans are always electric here. Yeah. Last time at the Nationwide, I had a lot of Latino fans, a lot of mo great Mohawk fans. So to come back with a different identity, with my true identity, it's an awesome opportunity, man. And I can't wait to get out on this big floor and let this bull fly. Man, you, you, you know how to bring the show. That's so, so sweet. I can tell that you really bring the energy when you're up there. Just watching you last time, it was so, so special. Um, so tell me, like, do you have, I know you probably have a million favorite fan interactions, but can you walk me through, like, one or two of your favorite fan interactions? Absolutely, man. So we have a lot, of, we have this opportunity that we call the pit party, which is actually where fans get to come down, hang out with us drivers, get to chat, we, you know, we get to talk, you know, with our fans and honestly just, you know, meet be, meet them and, you know, honestly, there's been a lot of interactions where I feel like I've, it's been more than just an interaction where it honestly feels like I'm meeting a, a brother, a sister, a, another mom or another dad, you know, and I honestly even have some uncles out there, honestly, <laughs> but on, there's been a lot of cool interactions, man, and this year I'm actually the St. Jude's ambassador for this tour, so I've had a lot of uh, cool opportunities, man, to talk with fans and get to know them, and honestly, one of the coolest things that I think always happens is, uh, you know, not too long ago, there was actually a, one of, uh, some fan that came out to a show and they were telling me that like, this is literally their one event this year that they uh, were able to come out to because their son is going through some sort of health, uh, you know, yes. conditions where he's, he can't be out in public too much. Mm -hmm. So he, won he wanted to come to Monster Jam and come hang out with us. Mm -hmm. And you know, um, just, for, just to hear something like that, you know, honestly, kind of brings you down for where, 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 however high you are and just kind of humbles you no matter where you are in life um, and just makes you realize like man this is much bigger than competing it's you know it's really all about the fans yeah. and I think I always try to have that interaction and uh, always kind of portray that image with all my fans because I once was a fan growing up man mm -hmm. so I know what it's like going to shows you know at, you know at a very young early age and honestly, just being that kid that would never leave the drivers alone, you know, just bugging yeah. them, asking them questions. And here I am now driving one, man. So I want to I want to extend that hand and honestly be that person that a lot of fans look up to. And, uh, you know, if they ever need need anything or are going through anything, I want to be there, man. Absolutely. You really are an inspiration to so many people, 100 percent. So thank you so much for taking some time out and interviewing with us. It's really been a pleasure. Yeah. So hey, thank you and thank you, Gary. Uh, you know, I've already been talking with him and we were just talking about, you know, how he's progressing the year. So that's really awesome, man. But I can't wait to come out here to Columbus and have a great time, man. I'm really excited and I hope to see you guys here. Absolutely. We'll catch you tomorrow on Sunday and for three incredible Monster Jam performances. We'll catch you there.